Guys, thank you. We're going to head now to the east side of Evansville, where students at Evansville Day School got to take a break from class to see the total solar eclipse. They had about 250 other visitors there with them. Our JC Caldwell was there too and gives us a look at the eclipse through the eyes of elementary and middle school students. I'm JC Caldwell here at Evansville Day School wearing my biker shorts and it's not every day I get to wear those to work, but it's also not every day you get to see a total solar eclipse and make some slime with these elementary and middle school students. And these students don't just go here at Evansville Day School, they actually took a little field trip here from Louisville. Like any other Monday. What are you yes. drawing? A cat. Class was still in session at Evansville Day School. <laughs> But don't think they didn't get the memo. This Monday was a bigger deal than most. Happy Eclipse Day! Especially a big deal for the younger kids. If you are eight, it's going to be your first one because the last one was a partial eclipse. Even if you're older than eight, it's probably your first one. It's going to be very cool. Cool enough that the school decided to host some visitors. Where are you guys from? Students from Louisville Collegiate School. It's our first day back from spring break, so it's glad I don't have class today. Like good hosts, Evansville Day School made sure the two-hour drive was worth being out of class for. Purple or blue moon has to go into the sun. Your team scores a point. So many different activities. All us. All us. What's been your favorite station so far that you've been at? Um, I'd say the slime one. Mine's not colorful, like your guys. Me neither. I didn't do colorful. Okay, I messed up on mine. Then it started to get dark. We're having a solar eclipse! What? We are? Yeah! yeah. All you Banana. can see is the sun and like the moon Banana moving the in. So what does the sun look like right now? Looks like the Cheshire cat smile. No, no, it's almost it's covering it. Face close. Look at it, it's pretty cool, guys. My life today, guys, my life was changed forever. I drove two hours to see this and it was worth it. I want to go to bed. I feel like we're in the back. What time does it feel like outside right now? 2 a.m. It's getting brighter. We have to yeah. put them back on. Here comes the sun and I say it's all right. How was it? It was so, so cool. Was awesome. I love so the color so of it. It was, it was amazing. Cool. This yeah. It was cool how it was like fully black. Okay. Once it was fully light out again though, it was time to grab your trash, clean up, and head home. Well, now that the long-awaited event is finally over, the students are headed back home and will have to wait until 2044 until the next one in the U.S. Reporting in Evansville, J.C. Caldwell, 14 News.